What's up guys, EDAD fam. I'm sure this is a familiar spot for a lot of you guys seeing the cool cars. And we just launched the Huracan, one of my favorites. That thing's dope. But today we're gonna show you how all this stuff is made. This lovely 8080 merchandise. Mm. So, mm. step one is the design process. And after that, it's gonna be taken upstairs, airdrop. Boom, airdrop. From somewhere or email. And. So, once we have the design for the t shirts, this is where all the magic happens. Not only for printing on the sheet to heat transfer it onto the design work. But we print all of our canvases, posters, stickers, anything that you see on the website is made in-house. It's going to be printed on some heat transfer sheet paper. I don't know. I don't do it, but we're going to do the best we can to show you how it's made. So once that's printed, it's going to go all the way down here. Hey, all aboard the How It's Made train on any of these boots. Hopefully I don't fall on. I need my drink, JD. <laughs> Slow it down. Huh? Slow it down. So many of you have may already seen this side of the shop with Stefan and Levi. This is where everything is stored and shipped out, all done in-house, pretty cool. So after we have the design printed on the sheet, kind of out of breath, so hold on. All right, so it's gonna be printed on the sheet. We're gonna be walking over here into our secret little room. It's built into wrong. <laughs> Little side note, that was the first heat press when we started in Justin's basement. We were making like a few shirts a day. We were stoked. But Moved up in life, huh? Yeah, it brings back good memories. Now, so once we have our sheet printed upstairs, they will put it on here, cut it out, tape it on a fresh screen, put it in this machine right here. Bada bing, bada boom, turn the old lights on. I, I, so this is what they, <laughs> this is what they look like, right? <laughs> this is the sheets you're talking about? I don't know how to work the machine, but yes. So, how it works, screen is on there. Hopefully you get this right. It might be wrong. Don't roast me if I'm wrong, <laughs> but the light's gonna come through here, burn this design onto the screen. Then they will tape the screen off. As you can see, we have some of the screens here. There's some tape, so I think I got the process possibly right. Where, where did I put my green? Oh, right there. Okay, so once we have the screen all down in here, these lights kind of mess with my eyeballs. Anyway, so the screen comes through there, which it will take it over here. So it's gonna, it's gonna look like this. A little choppy. Obviously, we can't screen print that. So, they'll bring it here. They'll, bah, you know, wash it out, make it look all pretty. Oh, just kidding. I don't want to ruin your camera. I don't want to pay for that. So, once it's all done, it's going to be taken over here. Oh, keep up, dude. I'm coming, dude. I'm coming. Am I talking slow enough for you? I, that's pretty slow good. Pretty good rate. I'm doing my best. I'm not a professional. So, this is the last step. We're not gonna start the last step. We're gonna start the first step. This is a pretty fancy machine, here. man. Okay. Step one. Build the shirt. Bada bing, bada boom. Lasers, line it up. Now this is where the screen will go. Okay, so there's different colors depending on what shirt they print, or if they're printing different shirts, they can run different amount of screens. So, shirt's gonna come over here. This thing is gonna go. The white ink stuff's gonna be on the shirt. And then it's gonna travel over here. This thing, yo, red chili D is gonna dry it. The first one is gonna travel over here. Trap, 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 trap. Which is gonna land us on our second color. Green number two. It's behind door number two. Red. Red. It's gonna come over here. It's gonna be our dear old friend. Oven number the two. Red chili D <laughs> for <laughs> another heat treatment. Let's go. Flash dry. And it's gonna travel over here. Watch your step. Don't trip. 
final destination. Like, not like the movies where a lot of people die. This one has a happy ending. Last step, comes over here. We got somebody carefully placing on this hot dog right here. Now, I bet if we put a couple taquitos in there, it'll be nice and toasty. Should this we try is, it? This is practically I'll a giant oven, baby. right? Like a giant oven, yeah? Big one. Think how many pizzas we could cook through now. We might as well just be a bakery now, huh? Ooh. All right, so, we're come through there, come through there, and then it's gonna be like, I'm going over there, the button. Wait for it. Oh my God, it's gonna come over here. Fold it all nice, neat, black. Best fold job ever. Oh, over there. After they fold it, it's gonna be on the cart right here. Oh, I forgot. I gotta slow down. Mm. So they'll stack it all nicely. Obviously, they'll fold it a lot better than I did because I kind of suck at that. But I'm gonna go over to that station over there. They will be putting these nice little tags on there. That's so you get the right merchandise, the right size. And so pretty much pops out of here, gets folded, gets placed on a cart like this. Then it goes over there, gets one of these bad boys on it, this right? One but there's also the sewing side of everything. Yep. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we gotta go back this way. Hats, duffel bags, hoodies, anything that has an embroidered logo. This is a whole nother story right there. That's an even cooler story. But they'll set it up in this jig, put the patch on there, put in the embroidery machine, just like that. This is what keeps it in place and perfect. So it'll be all sewed on there. That is a just fancy like that. machine. Now, check out the hats. So I'll place them in this jig. Bada bing, bada boom. Start like that. Come out like this. This one still needs some fixing, obviously. So, but cool thing about that, this one right here, my dog, my guy. These are all hand sewn. Over there. Hand sewn like hand professionals. Sewn. Yeah, every single one. So, I'm loving these. It's either done by. Professional this. or a very, very expensive machine? Yep. Very expensive machine, huh? And that's also a very expensive machine. That's like, uh, let's see, a couple Lambo, GTR, Lambo, Lambo. This is all before the price was inflated, <laughs> of course. Now, once everything has embroidered, screen printed, tapped up, folded, it's gonna be making its way on over here. Which a lot of you have may seen on some videos with Levi and Stefan. Chris's tree's still up because it looks so good. Mm -hmm. Now we're just too busy to take it down. Way too busy. Um, so anyway, so every bin and tag and everything has its specific place, sizing, logo, stuff like that. So ends up here and then boom, somebody places an order. We won't show this one because we don't want to give away any information. They'll scan it. But oh, I need this shirt, this size. Pull it out, scan the barcode, bada bing, bada boom, pack it up, it's on the way to you. I told my squad we gonna make it out. One way or the other. Yeah. I had some hoop dreams, but no jumping like I'm at them. My pen is too clean, so I had to stick with rapping. My life is hella deep, dog, you couldn't even fathom. My goals are like Twitter, you can see I'm staying at them. I'm trying to be the GOAT. Every day I'm chasing ghosts like I'm Danny Phantom. And I can sell a nigga, but I really sell a hit. It's my niche. And business sent the beat, so I had to hit the switch. And I am all in. I ain't on the fence. All these rappers peep my game. I ain't talking Twitch. Man, I'm trying to get rich. I'm trying to make my wrist match the plaques. I started from the bottom. I ain't going back. Told all the dogs we gon' make it out. I would never fall. You can't take me out. I'm popping like a zig, I'm breaking out, and I am hella lit, you on the couch, 
They said I wasn't good enough, but they sent one near and not the other. And they don't want to see me shine like they close the shutters. But when I said I'm top five, I didn't stutter. I put the six on my back like my name is Color. And I got the game in my hand. You would think I'm wearing cutters. They were sleeping on me like they tucked in some covers. But now I got everybody woke like they BLM. Now it's over like I'm pressing Sim. It was looking dim. I slim like M. It was sink or swim. They hated me but loved them. Yeah, they put me in the rough, but I was a gym. Told all the dogs we gon' make it out. I would never fall. You can't take me out.